it's Juan Per 720 or Rudolph. Uh, both of them have been at the top of our magical drop echelon for quite some time. And will today be the day that one of us can finally crack through? Or are they just fated to meet in finals again? If they do meet in finals again, I think that would be, what, seven consecutive tournaments? This is our sixth monthly, but we had one before this, so... Well, I think they didn't meet in finals one time because of a, a power outage. The only person who's ever beaten one of them is Mother Nature, besides each other. Good awareness to know that he only had six left and just clean it up real quickly. Okay, I already have the drop pattern set to this character, so I don't need to switch anything. Good time for just stopping the advance of the bubbles at the very edge of his screen there by Wanpa. Uh oh. Okay, Rudolph catching a break. Or, um, FSJ catching a break there. But then a missed drop is gonna kill him. So a quick 2-0 lead for Huanpa here. We're going to death. One thing players like Wanpa and Rudolph do that really sets them apart from some of the rest of us is how well they use the floating time, where the bubbles are kind of going to where they should be after you throw them, to rearrange the rest of their board. It always seems like they're thinking just a little bit ahead of everyone.
So FSJ on his final round here trying to take one off of Juanpa. Or is he going to go unopposed straight to winner's finals? Ooh. Almost a little bit of an issue there. All right, so Wanpa gonna take it 3-0 over FSJ. I'm gonna head back to our bracket here. 